Welcome back to the broadcast. Well, sweet and salty are great combinations, and we've got a new strawberry ginger salsa recipe that goes perfectly on a grilled tuna steak. Here to show us how to make it is Stephen Pilot, chef and culinary instructor, and I can't wait because it smells so good in here. Well, good. Glad you're going to enjoy it here. Help so you out a little bit? You bet. You so that, bet. And this seems really easy, too. We were talking about it a little. So what's the process here? It's just... Um, Probably the process that's going to take the longest is cutting everything up. Mm -hmm. And then just mixing it is, is not a problem. You do want to let it sit for about half an hour, 45 Marinate, minutes. Marinate, all so the, get the flavors. Yeah, get the, the juices to kind of funk in there. Mm. And, and you want to get some more of the juices there so, on the bottom. So Yeah, what would you make here? So we've got the uh, strawberries, which I have them already cut which up I here. Which I want to so, taste while you're talking. Okay, and we're just going to mix in some of the strawberries that are cut up here. So And I have, mm. I have these strawberries right here. These are eight strawberries. That's it. Eight strawberries that have the same amount and more of vitamin C than an orange does. Mm -hmm. So, so we want to... Some onion. Onion. So we've got some red onion, some chopped ginger. And you've got everything chopped very finely, I see. Nice and small. Mm -hmm. We've got some jalapeno. We want to get that really, really, really small. Jalapeno mixed with what? A little bit of chopped garlic. A and little bit. Yeah. There's a whole bunch in there. <laughs> well... But why, what is it about the jalapeno that goes so well with strawberry? We, like here, we have our, our, our vinegar that I just I made up. It's mm -hmm. a strawberry, ginger, and I got a couple of hot red peppers in there. So you want to go like, we we're talking sweet and salty. Mm -hmm. We'll do sweet and a little spicy. Ooh, I love so it. So when you get that jalapeno kind of burn to mm -hmm. it, the sweet will, will take it away. So you just so mix that up? I'm just going to mix this up with a lot mm. of fresh cilantro, fresh chopped mint. Yeah. So we're going to mix this up. All right. If I can grab, get you to grab the olive oil and that's the, that's uh, some of our strawberry vinegar. Okay. So just go ahead with the olive oil. Pour the whole thing? All in there. How much is, how much is this in here? It's about uh, uh, two ounces. Okay. So we got two bad. ounces there. And olive oil is healthy for you. You bet. That's yeah. the extra virgin. And there's virgin. your vinegar. Here's our vinegar. And mm. it's a, it's a rice vinegar. So it's nice. It's crisp. Doesn't have a really, really strong flavor. A little bit of Lime juice. Mm. Oh, there we go. This is healthy and delicious for the summer. We want lighter recipes, it, right? That and you don't want to have in the kitchen so so much heat. Mm -hmm. So I do a lot of grilling in the summertime. I sweat a little bit, but it's keeping the heat out of the kitchen. Plus, you don't want heavy butter, cream, right? sauces. So this is doesn't just go well with bikinis. Well, yeah. this, but this stuff is is really really good. You can even so serve do you this. salt and pepper it up a little sure. bit. Sure. We're gonna do a little bit salt. Give me some some of the pepper there. Okay, all righty. All right, so, so what do we do with the tuna over bring here? Bring the tuna out. All right. <clears throat> and we are going to... I love how easy this is. This is great. Isn't that great? Yeah. If it could only work that, that, that well on, the on magic, Sunday. The magic of TV. There, there we, we go. go. So we're going to do our, our tuna steaks. Mm -hmm. Okay, just... Which you just grill those up real grill quick, right? Grill these up. And all I did was a little bit of olive oil, salt and pepper mm -hmm. with the tuna steak. And then what we're going to do is just spoon the, the salsa on top. It smells so good. Cascading down a little bit there. And so we were talking about those juices. You want to get yeah. a lot of those juices. How long would you grill the tuna? It depends on how you like it. Some folks like it with uh, that, that little pink in the mm -hmm. center. So you want to go about two or three minutes on okay. each side. And we can, if you want to That's it, it, so it's done? There Just we are. Just that simple? It is very, very, very simple. You can use grilled tuna. You can do, uh, it's great with grilled pork. So we can do so here, here, there we go. Thank you. Yeah, it would be great for for tuna, mm. snapper, any kind of fish. Just Good put stuff. A little bit on top there. So. so easy. Okay, we've made a couple of fun summer strawberry recipes today. So if you'd like to get them, you know all you have to do is go to thebroadcasttv.com and click on today's links to get these amazing recipes. I'm getting ready to eat this, but let me tell you this. Have you ever learned how to salsa dance? Well, we're learning a little bit more when we come up. Come back, so come back, I'm gonna eat. You wanna so join me? Salsa and salsa. Salsa and salsa, they go together. Okay.